Let's look at a brilliant opening trap. We start with the Sicilian and then you'll play the tricky little wing gambit. Black thinks that if he takes the pawn, white will easily get a perfect control in the center. Therefore, he plays e6 and defends the pawn. But after takes takes, you'll still push d4, forcing the bishop to go back, maintaining pressure along this diagonal. Then c3, consolidating the center. Black tries to break through, but you can simply push e5 and strengthen this pawn chain. Knight c6, he's building up an attack. We'll develop the bishop and he brings out his other knight, preparing to castle. We will do the same and now if he castles, then he is gone. Let me show you how. We start with the bishop sacrifice. King takes and now it's a check with the knight. If he comes out in the open, we have all these different attacks so he won't survive long. Therefore, he goes back to g8 but after queen h5, black is finished. Even if he tries to make some space for his king to run away, we have this cunning move, bishop to a3 and there is just no way he can stop this checkmate. 